hello 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 so you clicked on this video because you want to see what the Rand McNally dash cam 300 is all about well we're gonna go ahead and open her up and then uh, we'll see what's in the box and later on today after I get done driving we'll uh, upload some uh, driving footage on here Don't mind the uh, the shaking here, and I just realized we're upside down with this. But uh, let's go ahead and open this box up here. Don't mind the shaking. Sorry, my truck's running. It's hot over here in Tennessee where I'm at currently. So you get a your normal uh, informational packet, your instructions. Let's see what else we got here. Right off the bat, you get the camera. It's kind of a nice little feel to it. Really light. Not too bad. Okay, I thought that might have been a button or something, but I guess not. Get all your normal buttons here. Let this camera focus in real quick, maybe. Looks like a fast forward, a rewind, or whatever. A, or, a, you know, move in the menus. A memory and a power button. You got the record button there and your camera button for taking pictures. So far, not, not a bad looking camera. Set that off to the side for right now. Got your little foam in there. More paper. So we got the mount. Let's go ahead and check this out. Power device hooks up there. Camera goes in there with the little prongs to power it. I do like that, you just kind of put it up on your window, like so. This thing will focus, and then as you turn it, you can see the suction cup kind of go in, so it'll pull up nice and tight. That's pretty good. I do like that, that'll be handy. Maybe it won't be falling off the windows. You got your power cord. Extra USB port for whatever you may need to charge a cell phone or whatever. Nice long cord too. Good thick wires. That'll be good. What do we got? Oh, this is probably a data sync cable most likely for uh, hooking up to your PC or whatever. You got a USB on this side and a regular uh, I forgot, I guess that's the micro USB, something like that. But it does have a big old power, like a fuse type setup in here. I'm gonna have to read the directions and see exactly what that's for. That might be just for uh, computer backup or if you wanna power it by a USB. We'll have to find that out. Well, that's all that's in the box. And uh, we'll go ahead and put this all back together real quick. Cause I'm gonna go ahead and throw this up on the windshield and go to deliver my load <coughs> and while we're there we'll get some daytime driving footage and some nighttime driving footage and we will uh edit this all up tonight And so while I'm editing this, I realized I do not have the nighttime footage. So you'll have the daytime here, and I will just do another update video later, after I've had the camera for a little bit, and do a nighttime footage then, along with some more daytime footage, and also my review about how I like or dislike this Rand McNally Camera 300. Thanks for watching. Feel free to watch the rest of this footage and uh, 
Leave any comments below of what you may think about the quality of the video. Just reviewing the quality of the video on my laptop, I'm actually really impressed so far. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video out if you would. If you subscribe, make sure you ring that bell so that way you know when I upload new videos or if I ever go live. That way you'll know when the other video that's going to follow this one for the update and the review on it when it gets posted. Thanks again for watching.